Oh, I've got my gloves on. I, uh, little jacket, my hoodie on. Where's the moon? There's the moon right in front of me. Just a little after 6 a.m. Saturday morning. Today's a 10 mile run. Did my math wrong. I thought it was only 9, but today's actually 10. I've got exactly like a month till the marathon. So I figured I'd just give it a try going in the morning because it's gonna be this early for the race. But man, it's like 35 degrees out here right now. I think my goal today, this morning, is to just kind of like, is just to do it. I'm okay if I walk, I'm okay if I run. I really would like to just run the entire time. So that's my goal just to go without stopping. Mile one, look at the river, how pretty it is. Two miles, if I could feel like this the entire time, that'd be great. Knees feel good, ankles feel nice, hips feel good, lungs feel good, the sun's coming up. Three miles, still on cruise control. Fog that way, fog that way. Looks like I'm out here by myself. All right, four miles, there you go, five miles. My face feels numb. It's still really cold out here. Six miles down. Look, the sun's out. That's seven miles. Another three miles. My legs are starting to get kind of tired and kind of heavy. All right, there's eight miles. Ooh, feels like I'm a little further away than two miles from home. <laughs> Got one mile left, just on mile nine. My, <laughs> my hips. My quads, my thighs, all that, they are like locked into this right now. Like, I feel like if I were to stop, there's no way I could keep going. But I also feel like I could just keep going without stopping. Route tracking was just a little off, I think. That's 10 right there. Uh, my legs. <laughs> well, that's 11 miles. <laughs> Woo! Wow, I'm done. My, uh, my lungs and everything feel great. I don't feel worn out. Like I don't, it's like I'm not huffing, I'm not puffing, all that kind of stuff, good. I was, my goal was just to go the entire time. So just nice, slow, steady, nothing crazy, not trying to pace, just kind of like trying to go. My uh, hips were pretty, no, like hips and quads were so tight that it's like, I probably could have just ran the half today. Let's get into some of the stats. This is where, this is where it gets kind of fun. 11.3 miles, uh, took me an hour and 48 minutes with an average pace of 9.33. I, I don't know. I, th that almost feels too good to be true is a 9.33 pace. So I don't under, quite understand that. Let's see, so mile one was a 9.50. Uh, let's see, mile five was a 9.32. Mile seven was a 9.28. Um, mile nine was a 9.30. Here's the kicker, mile 10 was a 9.18? And a 9.18 on mile 10, and mile 11 was a 9.25? So I mean, my pace was pretty dang consistent. It's making me feel pretty optimistic for this half marathon. If I can keep my training going, um, if I can keep some of these long runs going, um, I don't want to curse this, but I feel pretty ready for this thing. Anyways, I call that a successful morning. I even tried to time things out this morning too, like half marathon time just to see how my body was doing. Kendra's at home cooking some bacon, some eggs with the kids. Gonna have a little breakfast. I wish I knew what today was, but you know what? Freaking 11 miles, we'll throw that a check. Come on now. Well, I also just looked at my step count and I'm at like 20,000 steps for the day and it's 8.07 a.m. Um, I think my biggest step day was about 25,000 steps. So, 
I think today is going to be my uh, record for my steps. Come on, maybe we're going to crush today on the steps. 20,000 steps at 8 o'clock. <laughs>